hey guys what's up my name is Sabina and thank you for coming to my channel if you're new here welcome nice to meet you virtual handshake and if you're not new here and you've been here before welcome back good to see ya yeah it was really corny whatever I apologize for no one today I'll be doing my January favorites and this month's a little bit random. I've really been liking the um, Wheels, Wales, I don't know how it's called, the Dr. Andrew by Origins um, serum. This one is for skin tone correcting and I have really bad red um, pigmentation so anything that I find with color correcting I snatch because I'm always self-conscious about my skin and this product, like, I feel like I notice my redness go away and I've had more even skin tone. I really like it. <laughs> um, so yeah, I definitely recommend this. Give it a go if you have some pigmentation problems. It's helped me out, so hopefully it'll help you out. Yeah, and I'm gonna post, I'm gonna post all the links down below as well so you guys can get them if you want it. My next beauty favorite is also a skin care product. I live in the tri-state area and it has been really cold here especially with the snowstorm that just happened that we literally had like over two feet of snow. It was crazy. Um, but yeah with the snowstorm it really dried out my skin the cold weather so I've been using the Glam Glow Thirsty Mud and oh my gosh I don't think I can live without this product anymore like it literally changed my life my skin was like glowing the next day um, I tried to use this like twice a week but it is a pricey product it's like $70 so I kind of feel bad using it all the time <laughs> um, but yeah it's really nice it smells like coconut and I'm obsessed with coconut oil right now so my shampoo everything's coconut <laughs> Yeah, but if you're on the drier side, I would give this a go. So my next favorite is these two MAC lip pencils. And I have been wearing these every single day. Like, I can't get enough. I'm, like, going through, like, this nude phase, but, like, a darker nude, like, brown tone. That's not nude. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm wearing one of them right now, and... Yeah, you're like, Sabina, this isn't nude. I don't know what you're talking about. But I don't know. That's the way I describe it. So, um, the two colors are In Control, which is what I have on right now. Sorry, my hand's dirty from my foundation. <laughs> and the second color is called Hover, and Hover is more of, like, the brownie tone where In Control is, has that, like, pink undertone. You can see Hover has gotten a lot of use. I've been wearing them a lot. So yeah, loving these. Another favorite of mine is a fragrance. I've been really loving the new Jimmy Choo scent in Illicit. Oh my gosh, this smells amazing. Oh my god, oh my gosh, this smells so good, guys. Let me just give the spritz. This is more like, um, like, I don't know, like a musky, like spicy scent maybe? Musky, I guess. I don't know. It's just, I don't, I'm awful at describing fragrances, guys. I'm so sorry. I can tell you the notes. Um, it has ginger, orange, rose, jasmine, and santal. I was trying to read like another language as I'm like, Santol, what is that? Found the American guys. <laughs> um, so the top notes are ginger and bitter orange. The heart notes are rose jasmine. And the base notes are honey, amber, and sandalwood. I don't know, like, I feel like when you think like winter, like, you think musky scents, like warm, like the amber brings out the warmness in it. Um, I, I just love this. Honestly, I think I'm going to wear it all year round, but it's just such like a nice, rich fragrance. And it lasts all day. Like that's like a problem I find. Like a lot of 
perfumes don't last on me all day um they'll last like for an hour and then i can't even smell it so i have to carry around roller balls this one lasted like literally the first time i put it on i smelt it on me the next day it was so strong so nice i love to wear this when i'm going out oh, so good so good i smell it one more time okay putting it away my next favorite is a candle it's um from bath and Body's works i think they came out in the fall or beginning of winter time i'm not sure it's when they had their um their wine collection this is the citron cedarwood and i can't find my big one anymore i think my mom took it for me um but i do still have the mini one and guys this smells so good it's like a citrus musky scent and it's just so fresh and sexy and nice and like i don't know if they're still selling this in stores because i don't see it in my bath and body works but they better be selling it online because i need to stock up oh my gosh i need to buy more i'm like afraid to burn this one because i can't find my big one and if i can't get this anymore then the scent is gone forever and i'm gonna be pretty upset my next two favorites are food favorites my first one is a tea and I'm like really really big on teas I don't drink coffee at all it makes my stomach upset I just don't like how I feel I'm all jittery and stuff so tea is where I get my source of energy and I've been really loving the Trader Joe's coconut green tea with lemongrass and ginger I really like green teas they're more like I don't know I don't know how to describe green teas but they're really nice um and the hint of lemongrass and coconut is really nice. I can't really taste the ginger in it. Ginger is normally spicy in teas and I normally don't like it because I don't really like spicy teas that much. But this smells so nice. It's a loose tea too, so it's a lot better for you because the ones in the packets come with like bad chemicals that you just don't really want in your body. And then my last favorite is a snag. I've been trying to eat a lot healthier, but... I have such a bad sweet tooth, it's crazy, so um, I needed chocolate in my life. So I got, um, I found these Emmy's dark cacao macaroons, and they're vegan, raw, and gluten-free, which I'm not vegan at the moment, but I do eat gluten-free, and I don't eat any dairy products at the moment, so with things like this, I need to buy vegan. Um, really good for you and it doesn't taste like it's really good for you it's actually amazing it kind of tastes like an almond joy but healthy and in a cookie form yeah. so I really am enjoying this and I'm sorry you're just getting the wrapper because I love them so much I ate them all <laughs> sorry but yeah that's all for my favorites this month um thank you for coming to my channel if you enjoy this video please give it a thumbs up and yeah if you're new please subscribe down below um all the links to my twitter tumblr instagram everything is also going to be listed down below including the products that i've mentioned in this video Please leave a comment down below with what you want to see next and what your January favorites were because I love reading those and I love shopping. So if you give me new ideas, that'd be awesome. <laughs> so see you guys next week. Bye.